Traditionally, Indian farmers have used the sun to dry their fruits and vegetables. This process increases their storage load. However, the same process is very time consuming. But things are set to change. A new machine can dehydrate food produce in much less time. Interestingly, this machine also uses the sun, not the direct heat, but solar energy. It's a slow day at this market in India's Aurangabad. Few buyers, a lot of haggling, and this is the result. Fruits and vegetables wasting away. Not long ago, these were fresh from the farm. Colorful, crisp, and hand-picked. Now they lie rotting away on the road. The problem here is shelf life. There is a short window to sell vegetables and fruits, and beyond that, it gets wasted. Two major problems. First was that there's a lot of wastage happening from your farm to your marketplace. Uh, and also at the same time, farmers not getting the right price for their produce. So both the things are something that actually appealed to me and that's why I got started with S4S where how can we reduce wastage and at the same time give uh, good income to farmers. Yeah, you can speak this to is Nidhi Pant, the co-founder of S4S Technology. Her solution, dehydration. Dried vegetables have a longer shelf life. Some experts say that they last for nearly 12 months. Now, Indian farmers have been drying vegetables for years, but until now, it was painfully time-consuming. Okay. In India, we have traditionally been practicing sun drying to dry the produce, but it takes 6 to 10 days for it to dry, leading to a lot of microbial and fungal growth. S4S have found the perfect solution, a dehydrating machine. It is simple to operate, has very few moving parts, and is powered by solar energy. Using S4S's solar conduction dryer, we have now achieved this in a more efficient way. In 6 to 8 hours, we can dehydrate it rather than 6 to 10 days. And also, there is a reduced microbial and fungus growth, maintaining 80 to, 5 to 95 percent nutrition intact. This machine could be a game changer in India. Here, production was never the issue, storage and distribution are. India needs 230 million tons of food to feed its population. And how much does it produce? 270 million tons. The key is to store and distribute this produce. And that's where this dehydrator comes in. Not only does it help boost the supply chain, it does so using clean energy. S4S is creating impact in three ways. First is that we are preventing the food from getting wasted. Second, this is done using the power of sun, using a clean tech uh, technology. Third is that we are empowering rural female farmers, giving them an assured additional income and also making them better decision makers in their families as well as the communities. How are farmers responding to this machine? With jubilation. Avoiding wastage is every farmer's top priority and this machine helps them achieve just that. So these are the smaller bits of ginger that used to be wasted, but now we cut it up and dry it with the solar drying machine. When it's dry, we send it to S4S, which has given us the chance to sell more produce and earn more money. It has changed our lives. I use the money to pay for school for my children as well as running the house. That's quality, quantity and speed. Check. The S4S dehydrator's simple method guarantees a fair profit for the farmers and those profits in turn drive the rural economy. And because of S4S control on the supply chain and their ability to use a very simple method uh, for this processing, they can guarantee that quality of produce. And that's where uh, uh, they get a premium, their margins look far better. And the best part is they share that profit with these micro-entrepreneurs. So it's also inclusive. This machine is a classic example of technology's multiplying power. The farmers used the sun before and they continue to use the sun today. But with technology, the results have been drastically different. South Asia Bureau, we on World is One.